Our mission is to surround students with a community of support, empowering them to stay in school and achieve in life. Communities and School Permian Basin works alongside the public school system to address underlying factors that hamper student success. What sets CISPB apart from other organizations is its model of providing a comprehensive range of community-based interventions that can help each student reach his or her potential. CISPB positions a dedicated staff member at the school in a full-time capacity to work closely with the school staff to identify students at risk of not graduating. The coordinator addresses each student's needs by establishing relationships with local businesses, social service agencies, and parent and volunteer organizations to provide necessary resources to students. Okay. All right. Good afternoon, Broncos. Uh, I'm on camera today because I ended up recording this before I realized that I would have my news crew around today, but whatever. So we had testing yesterday. Um, it could have went better. Could have went up a whole lot worse, though. So um, next week we have testing, too. Next Wednesday. Uh, I forget what we have other than... The SAT testing for some people. We have a couple more benchmark tests. So if yesterday was any indication, if you ended up in a classroom sitting around being bored because there wasn't a Chromebook available, bring your Chromebook. Should have it every day anyway. Charge too. So bring your Chromebooks. Make sure you have your IDs. Seniors, you guys don't have testing. I don't think you have a meeting for graduation in the pack. Make sure you're there. You'll get all the information that you need most of the information you need to get for graduation tonight here on campus at six o'clock we've got an information meeting uh there's a trip to italy in 2024 um ought to be a good time i mean it's italy it's europe europe is cool so if you are interested in going use qr code register for it show up at the meeting make sure you bring a parent or a guardian with you so you can get everything you need to know for that uh, meeting. Um, in other news, the other day, Tuesday, our boys basketball took on El Paso Coronado and they blew them out. Final score of that game was 86 to 53. We took the lead early and just never really gave it up. Our next game for them is going to be on Abilene tomorrow at 8 p.m., we're taking on North Crowley. If you can make that drive down to Abilene, do so. It, man, you should have been at that game on Tuesday. It was good. And I hope for just as much goodness on tomorrow's game. Uh, last but not least, I'm the yearbook guy, so i got to mention it. If you want to get your pet in on the pets page, scan the QR code, submit it, make it a good picture, high quality, higher quality pictures, get noticed better, uh, get more notice, and are more likely to end up in the book. We also want you to appear in the picture with your pet. You I mean, it is your book, not your pet's book. So try for that. Um, if you need to buy a book, yearbookordercenter.com. Um, and if you plan on ordering a baby ad, get those in quickly because I'm running out of room in the book for them. So I can't take too many more. So if you want to get those, get those into the book. Make sure you order one like soon, like today. Um, and if you buy a book and a baby ad at the same time, you get a little bit of a discount. So I think that's everything I got to really talk about today. Y'all stand for the pledges, and we will see you tomorrow. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Honor the Texas flag. I pledge allegiance to the Texas one state under God, one and indivisible. Please remain standing for a moment of silence.